um welcome back and um in this video we're going to look at nifedipine its uses mechanism contraindications and side effects so what is nifedipine it is a calcium channel blocker and it's available under the brand names adalat nifelat and so many other brand names Uses, it's used uh, in the treatment and management of angina, hypertension, pulmonary hypertension. It also has off-label uses, which include uh, it's used in the treatment of Raynaud phenomena and anal fissures. Strength, it's available in capsule form of 10 mg and 20 mg. It's also available as an extended release tablet uh in uh, 30 mg 60 mg and 90 mg mechanism of action it inhibits transmembrane influx of extracellular calcium ions across myocardial and vascular smooth muscle cell membranes without changing serum calcium concentrations uh, which results in inhibition of cardiac and vascular smooth muscles contraction thereby dilating main coronary and systemic arteries. Contraindications. Uh, Nifedipine should not be given to patients who are hypersensitive to it or other calcium channel blockers. Should not be given to patients with cardiogenic shock. And also, it should not be given together with strong CYP3A4 inducers such as Rimfabine, Rifabutin, phenobarbital, phenytoin, carbamazepine, St. John's Watt, because this uh, it reduces the efficacy of nifedipine. Side effects. Most common side effects of nifedipine include dizziness, peripheral edema, flushing, heartburn, headache, nausea, mood change, muscle cramps, nervousness, cough, palpitations, wheezing, transient hypotension, urticaria, pruritus, constipation, chest pain, among so many other uh, side effects. If you experience any one of these, let your healthcare provider know immediately. So that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching.